I am a big fan of the Caddy Buddy teleprompter. In fact, I'm using it right now. I did a comparison between the Caddy Buddy and a similar teleprompter a year ago. You can find a link to that video at the end of this video. In that video, I found two faults with the Caddy Buddy, and I recently learned that they've eliminated those problems on their current version. So I'm posting an updated review of just the Caddy Buddy, and I'll share how you can get the new parts if you already have the older version. So you're getting a little behind the scenes in my studio. I just pulled the tripod and teleprompter here uh, so that you can see this. I'm recording this on my iPhone. And what I'm gonna do is just go through, this is the Caddy Buddy. Uh, you can kind of see it here. It's got this, comes with this black fabric that drapes over it. And I'm not really gonna cover how teleprompters work. I'm just gonna really cover the features assuming that you are familiar with these teleprompters. I'm just gonna take this piece by piece and we'll start with the, the black fabric that comes with it. And what I like about this, there's two things I like. One of them is an improvement. One of them is the Velcro that attaches to the frame here. Mike has replaced this Velcro with a stronger adhesive so that it's not peeling off. And so if you've had a, uh, a teleprompter before, you'll notice that's a pretty common problem is that the Velcro is peeling off. Uh, and I actually, this is another thing, I just changed this. I, I kind of ironed mine to have a little bit of a bend to it. So you could do that too, uh, but it comes straight. So let me just put this back on and you'll see here, one of the things that I like is that he sewed in this kind of foam rubber uh, neoprene stuff, and that is able to rest on the lens and keep the, the fabric from falling in front of the lens. So it's pretty nice. Let me just pull it off again. And I'm just gonna go through this. So let's start at the front with the tray. The tray is adjustable. There's a little, this is, the Caddy Buddy is super adjustable. That's one of the things I really love about it. But the tray is adjustable. And so you're able to move your iPad back and forth depending on the height of your camera to get it centered. Uh, there is in here a smaller tray to hold your iPhone if you're using an iPhone instead of an iPad or Android device. Um, and Moving back, also adjustable. You have a couple of settings here. You can have it a little higher or a little lower, and you can also fold it all the way down, which is great for transporting or storing. Also worked, I've also worked with uh, teleprompters where the, the glass is always just permanently angled, and they're just kind of a pain in the butt. So let's pop that back up, tighten it down, and continuing to move back, they've got uh, these 15 millimeter rails, which are very standard. And this is another improvement that they've recently made, is how the teleprompter connects to the tripod. So the old system was a metal plate, and just because the plate wasn't very big, there was some play in between the teleprompter and the tripod. And here, there, I mean, there's this tiny bit of, of play, but that's solely because there is rubber on this tripod. Otherwise, it's firmly connected to the tripod. Uh, without that play that was there before. So good job on this. The other thing they're doing is that they've added more adjustability. It used to be uh, in place right about here, but they allow you now to move the whole thing back and forth on the tripod. And what's great about that is you can get your camera, get the center of gravity on, your, on the whole thing right above the tripod. And the reason for this, I actually know the reason for this. If you forget, which I've done, to tighten this guy up, and then you forget what I've done to tighten up your tripod and your tripod starts to, if this under the old system, the it wasn't balanced and there'd be a lot more weight if you're using a DSLR, the tripod would fall back and then the camera would fall off. And like I said, I did that. That was a very sad day, but uh, it was not the Caddy Buddy's fault. It was my fault, but they fixed it so that that's much less likely. So for klutzes like me, it's much less likely to happen. Um, like I said, this is adjustable. You can move the camera back and forth. Uh, if you're using an iPhone, you want it closer uh, or a small camera, but you've got a lot of flexibility there. You have flexibility with it moving up and down too, which is great. And um, they've got you know, a, a nice big screw here to, to mount the, the quarter 20 screw. And of course, that's kind of the standard adjustment, but it's really easy to use. It's not some, you know, funky uh, funky screw or, or whatnot. It's a nice big screw. Um, so that's it, Patty Buddy, extremely adjustable. A couple of nice new features on it. And if you've got the older version without these nice new features, you can, 
connect with Mike at Caddy Buddy and he can get that out to you. So that information will be down, down below. I really like this teleprompter. It saves me so much time. Uh, very excited that it's getting even better. And I, I hope if you're considering getting one, you go and do it. I love that Caddy Buddy is a small business. You can order this through Amazon, which is super easy for me, and I've got an affiliate link below. And you can also call or email Mike directly, especially if you want those new parts. I've got his contact information down below. He's a super nice guy. So click the link below to get your teleprompter today. Creating videos is so much easier and faster for me when I'm using a teleprompter. And it's quicker to edit the videos too. If you're thinking about it, I suggest you go for it.